All right, we're here in Wisconsin at another small creek. And I have a kind of a, not a secret rod, but a rod that I don't think anyone's really used too much or there's not many videos of it. But anyway, I'll get to that here shortly. I'm trying to sneak to this hole here. So let's see if we can't catch some brook trout or chubs or something. Got a little futsu on here, kabari. This rod is eight foot six, five five high flex. And I think I see some fish moving. Yep. There's a rise, another. Let's do bow and arrow. I'm gonna hold this position a little bit and not move so they think I'm a tree. Then we'll maybe catch some fish. Right, put a little bit bigger kabari on. Actually, probably double the size. Size 12, I think it is. But anyway, great time to tell you what rod this is. This is the Badger Tankara Rocky Creek Special. It was uh, designed by Matt Sment and Mike Lutz. And it is a 5'5 five five high flex, uh, eight and a half, or sorry, eight feet six inches. And uh, yeah. I don't know if Tom Bailey and Tao Tenkara are going to make this anymore, or the, if they even do. Um, again, it was like a, a prototype rod, so Matt, or I'm sorry, Mike was kind enough to let me borrow it, and so that's why I'm fishing it. Oh yeah, it's way easier for me to see, so hopefully easier for the fish to see too. But a really fun small stream prototype rod that I've never fished with before. It'd be kind of fun to see if I can catch something. Although it's a very sunny 53 degree day here in Wisconsin in February, which is definitely not the norm. Um, and crystal, crystal clear water might make it tough. This looks really good. Especially underneath that shadow. The trees are clear. Oh, there's some little fish in there. I wonder if it's chubs. All right, I put about six feet of tippet on because it's gonna be tough to get these pools otherwise. I see some movement down there. There we go. Kabari is underneath the water now. See them feeding up there. That was a bad cast. Move up ever so slowly. Oh, someone's looking at it. Something had it. It goes a chub, spit it out. Just scared one from way up there.
There we go. Ooh, it's a brook trout. <laughs> oh, get off the ice, dude. Thanks, buddy. Oh, gosh, they're fast. I think that's going to bite again. Totally missed it. <laughs> A monster. They're so well camouflaged, too. Oh, here comes one. Boom. Oh, came back for it. He's still out there. Definitely felt it. I don't think he's going to eat again, but he might have been that active one. Here he comes again, here he comes. He's hungry. Oh, dang it. Just nibbled on it. fish up there. I see one right there. Alright, let's try to get this guy one more time. Oh, here comes one. I'm coming back for it. Oh, I pulled it right out of his mouth. Dang it. I don't think he felt it, though. <laughs> oh, this is fun. Oh, there he is. Oh my gosh, how did you not eat that, dude? He had it, pulled it right out of his mouth. That's the same guy three times. It's right here. Come on. <laughs> Gotta catch him. There's a bunch of chubs over here too. That's uh, kind of looking. There he is. Yeah, I got him. <laughs> the fourth time's the charm. Ooh, it's a beauty. Oh. It's alright, we're gonna count that. Alright, the other ones are still up there. Let's see if we can't catch a chub really quick. It's a pretty good rookie up there. He might come back for it. He, he did before. right there so that's why I'm doing the sideways cast put it right on always turn around ooh he look opened his mouth didn't want it I'm gonna plop it right on his head see he just ate there there we go yeah he sees it oh another one Well, I'll go for this one. Ooh. 
That is a pretty one. Gotta get the net out for this guy. Man, is it a joy to fish brook trout like this with a small rod. And when they're eager to eat. There's a couple right there. Might be a chub. Maybe it's the one I just caught. Coming down to him. That's a little one. He's looking. Nope. All right, bone arrow cast, because all this is behind me. Actually. Who was a fish? A bit again. Haha, <laughs> missed that hook set. I was looking up. <laughs> well, there you go. That's a chub. <laughs> Chub's biting it. Boom. Thanks, dude.
Oh, one missed it. Might have been him again. There he is. <laughs> Ooh, that's a nice one. He's off. Oh, there's one that bit. I didn't get it. He missed. There he is. Best one of the day. Keep him in the water. Sorry, guy. It's a good one. Oh, get off that rock, dude. Missed it. Look at that bug. It's a pretty good one. Look at the flex on this. Lots of beauty too. Look at that chunkster. Yes.
Oh, there's a fish down in there. Missed it. There he is. Oh, he's in the water, dude. All right. There you go, released himself. I don't know. Oh, that was a fish. Thought I had a snag. <laughs> that was a surprise. Oh, little guy. Let himself off. The uh, fly is getting tore up. It's Kabari.
to get on. That's so cool when they come out of nowhere like that. Oh, I see now. One right there. Might be a chub. Flies right on it. Oh, he's looking. Looking. Chub. Two cream chubs today. Followed that forever. Alright, let's see if there's a trout there. Maybe it was that guy though. Nice brookie. It's about the cast and caught him. Hold up. Subtle, subtle nibble. There he is. He's off. Look how tore up that one kabari is. I put on that small white futsu at first and nothing. Put this on. And they were loving it with about six feet of tippet too. This thing is tore up. All right, what do I think of the Badger Tinkar Rocky Creek Special? I think it's a nice little rod. I wish they actually made it so you could buy it, but you never know if Tao will make it or not. But uh, thanks to Mike Lutz for letting me borrow this, and thanks to Matt, Matt and Mike for making it. Um, it's a super fun little rod, especially when you're on a creek like this. Uh, going for a smaller fish. So yeah, I had a blast with this. So thanks for watching. See you in the next one.